What? About 10 years ago, a fruit fly called the spotted wing Drosophila started wreaking havoc on Oregon farmers. And it's a vinegar fly that really is native to Southeast Asia. Each year since, it has cost fruit growers in our area millions in crop damage. It's costing, on average, growers about $7 million every year to manage, just manage this problem here in Oregon. Up until recently, the only way to control the pest was through insecticides. But the more those chemicals were used, the more resilient the bugs became. That's a very, very big problem for our growers. They have a few insecticides that they can use, and they're now at the point where they're starting to find um, that these insecticides are not that effective. It's been a tremendous issue. But a team of Oregon State University researchers led by entomologist Vaughn Walton has found a much more natural way. And it comes in the form of this tiny wasp. The wasp kills the fruit flies by laying its eggs in the cocoon-like structure of the flies. As a result, growers don't have to spray as much insecticides on their fruit. The environmental benefits is that uh, growers can potentially use less insecticides. Uh, they don't have to spray as much. Uh, insecticides on their on their fruit. And for those worried about what this wasp will do to things other than the fly, the researchers say no need to worry. The wasp is native to Oregon. So it's not as if we're uh, releasing these bugs that will start stinging us and attacking us and attacking other bugs. They're already out there. We're just helping these natural processes to occur more efficiently. And the researchers say many farmers are already using the wasps as a natural form of pest control. They don't yet have the estimates on how much money it's saving the growers, but they do know the wasps are significantly reducing fruit damage. And that is the break farmers have been waiting for. Keely Chalmers reporting there.